Hey, what's going on everyone? DJ Zeus here bringing you guys another video. And this is a follow-up on how to revert back to your um, OS that your MacBook Pro shipped with. Basically, all I did was turn it down. I mean, powered it off. Power it off. You have to hold down Option, Command, R, and then hold on the power button until you see this thing pop up. It's a little globe spinning and then this little loading bar right here will load. And as soon as this is done, it'll take you to the next step. So once the little globe uh, spinny loady bar was finished, this screen popped up and now this is going to load. And as soon as this is done, I will show you guys what the next step looks like. Okay, so here's the next step. This, uh, after the Apple logo and the load bar um, loaded all the way, uh, this thing pops up. So you go into Disk Utility, click Continue. This will pop up. And here you have your OS X Base and then your Macintosh HD. So you want you want to do is click on your Macintosh HD which is your um, internal hard drive or SSD and then you're going to click on erase make sure it's Mac OS uh, extended journal name you can keep it the same unless you want to change it to something else and then click on erase do you want to erase yes now prepare your disk Now if you click on it, it shows that you're available and your capacity are pretty much almost identical. Then when you're done, click on the X to exit out of here and then reinstall OS X. And here you go, OS X Yosemite and just click on continue. Download and restore OS X. Your computer's eligible. Our eligibility will be verified through Apple. So go ahead and click continue. And then agree. I have read the terms, blah, blah, blah. Click agree. And then choose the disk that you want to install it on. So it's going to be your internal hard drive or SSD. Click install. Your computer is not connected to a power source, um, so you can plug it in, or you can just continue. I have 69% power, and this will start recovering um, straight from the internet. So it is just about done, and basically this is how you revert back to your original OS if you've accidentally upgraded to El Capitan. Um, so. So just in case after that uh, screen went black right now, it'll reboot and this reboot will take a little bit longer because it's reinstalling everything. So. so once that is done, this screen will pop up and then it'll take a few minutes to actually install the OS to your hard drive. When, and when the installing is done, the screen will pop up again and start loading and there you have it. You're now back to Yosemite or your original OS that your MacBook shipped with. If you guys found this video helpful or useful, as always, make sure to give me a thumbs up, uh, click subscribe, comment down below, and thanks. Till next time.